Welcome to the homework for lesson 16. This is module 4 of grade 1. Write your name here first. Easiest question to answer, so make sure you take, get that one out of the way first. Draw quick tens and ones to help you solve the addition problems. So we're, now we're drawing our pictures, but uh, I, I want to keep using the method that we learned in, uh, that we practiced in lesson 15 of just looking at the ones first. And that's how I'm going to draw the pictures. You can still count that up. I mean, it's only two more from 17, 18, 19. We know it's going to be 19. But when I draw it, I'm going to think, and you have to draw it, you have to draw the quick tens. So I'm looking at that 7 plus 2. That's what I'm going to have to draw first. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then that's the two more. And then there's the 10 for the 17 there. 19. Number two, now I'm looking at the seven plus three. That's going to make a ten, right? So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, and there's the ten for the seventeen there. So, not to make too much of a big deal about it, but it's just the order that I'm drawing it in. The picture is going to come out the same no matter what order you draw it in. So, but I just like to think of. I want to look at the ones first, and so I'm drawing the ones first. That's all. And you can see that that's 17 is still a quick 10 and seven ones. And these are the three, the three more for the second add in that I added. And of course, the, that makes a 10. So it's 20. 14 plus 3, and I'm thinking 1, 2, 3, four ones and three more ones and of course that 14 has a 10 so this is going to make 7 and 10 17 and this 24 plus 10 we've got two tens we're adding tens is so easy one two three four there's no ones to add here because it's zero ones into ten there's a 10, and then we just count the 10s, 10, 20, 30, and then those four ones we add to the 30, 34. Make a number bond or use the arrow to solve the addition problems. Okay, so now we have a couple other choices to use. The number bond, I'm looking at this 24, and I see that 6, and I'm thinking that there's a 6 and a 4, and that's that makes 10. So that's what I want to do here, is I want to take this, I would think of it as 20 and 4. Sorry, that looks like a 9. There. And I'm thinking 6 plus 4 equals 10, and the 20 plus the 10, 30. And then... Here I'm looking at 14 and 20. Now just to do it, I'm not going to do it both ways, but I, I just want to show arrowway also. You can do this with number bonds also. It's fine. I would split up the 14, the 14 into a 10 and a 4 for a number bond. And that's kind of how it's going to look arrowway too. It's just the way that you do it in your head is how you write down arrowway. I would look at the 20, and I'm going to start by adding the 20 and the 10 from the 14. So I would start with the 20, and here's how you write it down, plus 10. That would get me to 30, and then I would add the 4. That's just mentally the steps I would do in the order that I would do them to get the 34. And now we're solving each addition sentence and matching. So 22 plus one more, 23. No reason to make it any harder than that. And then we see this 13 plus 6. If you know 3 plus 6, you know that's 9. And 10 more, 19. And let's just see uh, if we can figure these out right away. Uh, the 22 plus 1, I need a 22. Here we go. 
this line right here has two tens and two ones. That's twenty. That's the twenty-two, and that's the one. So that matches up. And then this nineteen is thirteen plus six. So we need to find a thirteen somewhere. That this one has too many tens. That has too many tens. This starts with a twenty-six. That's no good. Here's the one that starts with a thirteen plus six. We split the the ten and the three apart to solve that. Just the way I did it, adding the ones first, adding the, that's the idea of doing it that way. Now let's look at the others. 3 plus 26, again I'm going to look at this 3 plus 6 and think that's a 9 and then add it to the 20 for 29. And here I see this 7 plus 3, that's a 10, so 10 plus that 30 is 40. And here 22 plus 10, the way I would do that one probably is, um, I'm thinking 20 plus 10, and then I would add the two, the two ones. So I would look at the tens digits, I'm going to make 30 there, and then add two ones for 32. And let's see which ones they match up with. The 3 plus the 26, so we need, uh, here, well this one starts here. You just added, just counted three more, air away. That's fine, that works. And then uh, 37 plus 3. So we need to start with 37 somewhere. And I think we can see that here. There's 30, and that's a 7. And you can see they circled the 1s together to make a 10. That's the one that goes there. And that means that this. 22 plus 10, here's the 22, there's the 10, and they're keeping the 10s and the 1s left and right. Match those up. And zoom out so you can see the whole thing.